Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is LaToya and today we're going to be unboxing a mystery box. You heard me correctly. If you are in love with mystery boxes like I am, but you're curious about what is inside, stay tuned. This is definitely the video for you. I actually got this mystery box off of Poshmark. Poshmark is a place where people can resell their clothing, usually high-end type of luxury clothing, um, but not necessarily um, luxury clothing like all different types, but they also do a variety of beauty products, fragrances, anything that you're interested in, and they also do mystery boxes. So let me just tell you, um, just in case you're interested in this particular box that I open, um, exactly who I got this box from off of Poshmark. Her store is called Cherie Lauren Boutique, um, and her handle is at Lady XUI. Um, so um, take a look at her boutique. She has lots of nice things on here um, for kids and um, for adults as well. So let's get into it, guys. Um, mystery boxes is something that I've been wanting to get into for a couple years now. So I am super, super excited. Um, I have my box right here. Just give me a moment. Here is how it came. I actually got this about three days ago. And if you're like me, like when I get something in the mail, I want to open it ASAP. So you guys, I waited until I could do this video to open it with you guys. So um, I'm super, super excited. Okay, so as you can see, this came as a regular postage box. It is a medium flat rate box, just like this. Um, I ordered this on February 25th and it came about, I think, March the 2nd, maybe. So it only took like a week or even less than a week to get here to me. Um, just so you know as well, um, if you're ordering a mystery box, at least from her shop, you get to choose the type of mystery box that you want. Um, so she has, uh, you get to choose like beauty products or um, the one that I chose specifically was like um, family or random. Let me look at the specific one so I can tell you guys exactly um what it was called okay so this was called a fun mystery box for all ages okay and it was 25 dollars okay so this um hopefully will give you a good idea of what you may get if you decide to check out her boutique okay guys so let's get into it finally we can look and see what's in here okay so i do have my box cutter with me and I'm gonna look into it. Guys, I am so, so, so excited. I have been waiting and waiting. And I hope you guys like this type of video um, because I have more things coming. Yes, I have more, more, more things coming. Ah. Let me just show you guys the inside of the box. It looks like she individually wrapped everything, which is super, super special to me. Or just about everything so the one thing that I can see automatically is a puzzle it is a 500 piece puzzle by puzzle bug and it looks like it is um, okay no it says exactly what it is it's an aerial view of Manhattan New York City all right by crazy art All right, very, very nice. First item out the box, 500 piece puzzle of um, an aerial view of Manhattan, New York City. All right. All right, and the next thing. Let's see if they're, oh, okay. So this was just an invoice. I'll put that right there. All right, next thing, next thing, next thing. Okay. So I see some more items, but I'm gonna put them to the side. Um, right here let's get into this one it's wrapped in some green tissue paper with a thank you on the front and it's taped up pretty cute 
All right. Oh, let's get into this. Oh, lots of items in here to share. Okay, lots of items in here, guys. So, the first is like some type of satchel. I'll let you guys see. All right, it's got a zipper on the front, and it looks like it has a handle. Um, let me unzip it here. Yes, so it's like a little crossbody satchel, multicolored crossbody satchel. I'll let you see the inside. It looks like it's just enough room for you to probably put like um, like your wallet or a couple of um, cards. And this will be cute to wear like if you're just going to like um, Six Flags and you don't want to carry your whole purse, but you want to have um, some money and things like your important things like your driver's license on you. Very, very cute. All right, next thing that we have is wet and wild um it looks like yes it is a wet and wild loose highlighting powder in the shade all grown up all right let's see if we can get a good shot of that can you guys see it all right and it is sealed up let's see so I won't open it, but it is pretty cute. I love the shimmeriness of it. Just to let you guys see the size of it. Very, very nice. Okay, so that is like the third item. Okay, next item up is a clip on spotlight. It is an LED light. Very, very nice. Um, you could probably, um, you know, clip this onto like a book or if you're working on a project in, you know, dim light, you could clip it on whatever object you need to, um, just to be able to see it better. I hope you guys can see this. All right. So that is the fourth item. Okay, next item are some snap elastics, okay? These are good for the hair, no tearing, no damage, easy to remove rubber bands. Those are very useful. We can always use extra rubber bands. I know for me, um, after a while, they get kind of loose after you've had them for a while and then you need replacement. So definitely, um, it is something that I can use. All right, and now we have some headbands. Very cute. It's three in the pack, red, white, and blue, and on the sides, don't know if you can see them, but it's got like little stud design on the side. Very, very cute. So cute. All right, next item. Okay, I have Studio 1886 Perfume. It is a perfume sample. This is the front. If you guys can see. And I do see that it is an Avon product. Okay. And this is the vial on the inside. All right, and let me just give it a smell. I am always looking for like different perfumes and it's only very few that I really, really like. All right, this is pretty nice. It doesn't seem like it would be like too overbearing, so I'll definitely give this a try. All right. Okay, so what do you guys think so far about this box? I think that it's pretty good. I think that it is pretty good so far. Still excited. Okay. So, the next item that I have are night vision glasses. 
night vision glasses. Very, very nice. You could probably use this, you know, if you are driving at night. And, you know, um, I know some people that, you know, if you're driving at night, um, some of the headlights can kind of blind you. So hopefully, um, you know, this type of item could help. Very, very nice. Yes, and actually on the um, packaging, it says for clear vision and nighttime driving. It says for nighttime driving. So that is very cool. All right, and the next item are Duracolor nail strips. Duracolor nail strips. All right, they have instructions on the back of how to apply it. You pick the size, you apply it and soothe, and then you trim the edges. Um, I'm trying to see what type of design this is. Let me see if I can get out the package. Let's get this out if I can. Here we go. This is the design. Well, you can focus. It's pretty cute. I wouldn't mind trying this. It says you can use it on your fingers and your toes. All right. Very, very nice. All right. Put that back in. Going on. All right, and the next item I'm going to pick up is a pair of stud earrings. And inside it actually um, even has a sticker in there, which I actually love stickers. I don't know about you guys. Comment below if you like stickers as well. Um, but this is a pair of stud earrings. All right, very cute along with a sticker and this is Belle super super cute very nice touch with the sticker I really do like those I really do like stickers okay and the next item is a watch. This is a very um, cool looking watch. It actually has some beaded detail and a, um, a butterfly detail on it as well. And it looks kind of vintage. It's got kind of like a vintage style to it. There's the front of the watch. And there's the back as well. All right, very, very nice. Okay, and last thing in this particular um, pouch here is a mask. All right, and let's take it out of the package, if I may. All right, and it's an animal print. Very, very nice. All right, putting it back in. So you guys, I don't even know how many items we have already, but I mean, it is, it is seeming like it is, is really worth it so far. So, so far, it looks like it is. All right, so back to the box here and the other items are open. So, um, what I have is a L'Oreal Paris Color Rissa Semi Permanent Color. Semi Permanent Color. Check that out. And it is in Tangerine 40. And it is for dark brown to light brown hair. Very nice. I haven't dyed my hair in like a really, really long time. Like literally it's probably been about like seven years, like a really, really long time. Um, and I would definitely do like the semi-permanent hair color. So maybe, maybe I'll try it out. Let me, let me know if you guys have tried this brand down below.
All right. All right, so the next object in the box is a fan. Let me open it up here. I'm gonna put that to the side. All right, open it up for you. All right, what's the design here? It looks like it's flowers. And the design is just on the front. But really, really nice. I've seen these fans like at Dollar Tree. And I've always glanced at them, glanced at them never bought them. So it's really, really cool to now have one of these. All right. So I'll put it here. And last but not least, um, this is a, it looks like it's a box. It looks like it's a wooden box. Okay, it's got the little lock on the front and the hinge on the back. All right, and on the bottom it says it's a wooden craft box. So, let's see, I'm looking for my box cutter. Okay, yeah, so I'll just open it up so you guys can have um, a look at it. And I can look on the inside of it. Okay. All right. Pretty nice. Looks like you could put, you know, um, a few pieces of jewelry in it to keep it safe. All right. Very, very nice. Okay, guys. So what did you think? What did you think? I'm going to go back and um, just double check to see exactly how much I paid for um, for this particular box. Okay. Um, yes. So actually, let me correct myself because I think I said that I paid $25 for this box, but I actually paid $20 plus $5.95 for shipping and plus tax. So um, it ended up being $27.77. So do you guys think it was worth it? Um, do you think um, it is things that you would use or you would not use? Um, let me know in the comment section. Um, let me look and see how many objects that I got today. Okay, I got one, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, nine, thirteen, 14 and 15 okay okay so today we got 15 items in the Poshmark um, random mystery box all right overall I thought that was a pretty good box I do think that when you include like makeup in a mystery box or even like the hair product, um, it's kind of hard to know if it's going to fit that person because you don't know if the shade's going to be right, what color of hair that person has um, to go with it. But that's what it is all about when you get a mystery box. Overall, I am uh, very pleased with the box. Um, again, if you are interested in... Um, and shopping with this particular seller, I will link their description. Um, or I will link their um, their shop in the description box. I hope you all enjoyed the video today, and I look forward to seeing you all next time. All right, you guys, take care. Bye bye.